Hey guys, Bing here. Um, today I'm going to talk about a curved floor. Question mark. Okay, so here, here, here I have this um, model in place floor, which is a curved. Um, it's actually a sweep. Okay, it's a sweep, and uh, the question is, can we model something? Similar to this, using just the floor uh, floor tool. Okay, so um, so so first, I'm going to show you what I will I will probably do if I'm not using model in place. So this floor, so we can use at split line. So I'll just go to the top, and uh, I'll add multiple. Split Split line to this floor, and then what I will do is go to the side view and uh, modify sub element. Oh hell! I just need to pick one point, drag it down, and pick the, the other point, drag it down as well. So. Just need to manually uh, adjust this adjust this floor to match the um, match the shape of the curved floor. Yeah, it's 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 a bit time consuming, but I can't find any other way to do. Okay, so down. So now, if <coughs> sorry, now we have this uh, actual floor with a shape close to this curved floor. So you can see that all these lines because the, all the faces are actually uh, flat, and then you will always see these lines unless you change you. you uh, uncheck this um, show edge so it's a bit hard to see I'll change this full type maybe yep so you can see it's not perfect curve but uh, it's quite close okay so this this is the the method I will probably use if I'm not using just using a gen, uh, gen, sorry uh, model in place so um, and also the difference is if if you go to let me show you if you cut a section so if I go section cut this one and if it's a structure floor so you can you will see the profile of this okay so when you change the detail level so you will see the profile of this floor of course if 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 it's a um, model in place, you won't see anything there, unless you cut the void. But uh, that would be not too much. <coughs> so, can let's let's also uh, actually um, hang on, where am I? So, floor. So, um, some might think that um, maybe we can just floor by face by the name of this tool it's, it, it seems like uh, we can pick a face to create a floor so can we pick a like curved mass face to create a floor the answer is no um, let me show you okay so model in place mass and uh, I'll just uh, I'll just quickly do a mass Up, drag this up and create a face. So this is a face, right? And the finish mass. So if I use floor by face, so you won't be able to pick this face. Okay. So the only thing, only tool you can use is floor uh, roof by face. 
and then you can pick this face and create a roof so um, this is a this is potentially another way to model this curved floor actually curved roof okay so um, here I'm going to show you uh, what this tool is for floor by face so this tool this tool is actually used for um, to create face using a solid mass okay so I'll create a mass and uh, um, we'll draw a shape on the on the level one and I'll just say create a form so it, like extrude it and then I'll change the shape maybe okay so now this is a mass solid mass and then if I go to elevation so you, I'll finish this mass actually so see all these levels I'll just uh, copy these levels okay and then go back to 3d view click on this mass create mass floor and then you can select all the levels check okay so now this will create all the so these are called mass floor they are not actual floors they are just a thin uh, piece of um, just the shape of uh, when the level when the level cut oh sorry uh, yes when the level cut the mass so this is the shape you, you get and then what we can do we now use this uh, tool floor by face and select all the uh, mass floor or floor mass and create floor so now these floor are actual floor each one and they they are flat floor if they're not curved so so this is what this tool for so floor by face is actually creating flat floor from this mass okay so okay so what's next floor we have roof we have floor we have so yeah so that's pretty much it so can we create a curved floor yes we can we can just we can just create a model in a uh, model in place and then just change the change the category to floor or we can just do a normal floor and somehow adjust the height of this uh, use sub, uh, modi modify sub elements to adjust the shape of the floor to somehow create um, to match the curve and also we can create a roof to use as a floor not floor by face okay um, if you have any question let me know um, and also if you find uh, another way a better method please let me know as well so thank you for watching and uh, I'll see you next time thank you bye